Ladies and gentlemen, I present the Dean of the Poole College of Management at NC State University, Ira Weiss. Thank you, Chancellor, and uh, you can come over and have my parking spot any time you want. <laughs> On behalf of the college, our students, alumni, faculty, and staff, I truly extend my sincerest thanks to Lonnie and Carolyn Poole for their most generous gift and the recognition it brings to NC State and especially to the Poole College of Management. Your gift is both an investment in the future of the college and a testament to the work that our faculty has done in the college's short 18-year history to bring us to this day. A gift of this nature has two major effects on the college. The first, in terms of reputation and recognition. This gift moves us into an elite status of a small number of business schools that have been gifted at this level. It provides a branding identity that differentiates us from our peer institutions. And it really sends a signal to the marketplace that we are a force to be reckoned with. It allows us to bang our chest, and we don't bang our chest often enough, and tell our story again as to the important work we are doing and how our focus on innovation and technology is highly aligned and so important to the region and economic growth. And most importantly, it validates the mission and values of the college. In doing so, it strengthened the value of the degrees held by our alumni and the degrees that we will distribute tomorrow and into the future. And it provides a great sense of well-deserved pride for our faculty and staff for their commitment and their service to the college. The second impact of this investment is in terms of what it will enable us to do. Looking ahead, this gift will enable us to strengthen our core academic areas with faculty leadership and endowed chairs and assist in retaining key faculty. To create competitive packages for bringing new, young, talented faculty to the college and to provide competitive seed funding assisting our faculty members in their efforts to secure external research funds. This gift will also allow us to advance the college into a new era by adding a new strong emphasis on the important issue of sustainability. In doing so, we will be expanding and complementing our research and programmatic focus areas that currently emphasize technology, innovation, entrepreneurship, and globalization. As a business college, we understand sustainability is a critical business imperative that yields a significant return on investment. It impacts our society, our economy, and most importantly, the environment, and it impacts the corporate bottom line. NC State has been long known for its work in sustainability, from campus-wide initiatives aimed at reducing our energy footprint as an institution, to research and outreach new units such as the Freedom Center and North Carolina Solar Center. It's now time to build the business case for sustainability and its return on investment. We need to educate future leaders to view sustainability and environmental impact as a complement to innovation and entrepreneurship, and to show that it not only is socially responsible, but also that it makes good business sense and that it must become a core value. Technology will play a huge role in sustainability innovation, and we here at NC State and at Research Triangle Park are in a great place to adopt sustainability and environmental impact as an ethical component of building future businesses. So to that end, I am pleased to announce today that we are going to create a center of excellence in sustainability within the Pool College of Management. <laughs> Together with our corporate partners, our international partners, especially our newest one, Schema, and the faculty of the college, 
We plan to set an academic research and outreach agenda that will put the Poole College of Management in the forefront of business leadership in the area of sustainability and environmental impact. This new focus reflects Lonnie's personal and professional commitment to sustainability, ethics, and social responsibility, as evidenced in his leadership of the Environmental Research and Education Foundation and his pioneering work in the solid waste industry. Through our Center of Excellence and through the college as a whole, we are going to pay testimony to Lonnie's legacy by making an impactful contribution to the body of knowledge and best practices of sustainability by providing real answers to today's real problems and preparing our students to bring the core values of sustainability and environment and ethical business practices into the global business challenges of the 21st century. Before I close, I want to take a moment to acknowledge our founding dean, Dr. Dick Lewis, who is here today, and Dr. John Bartley, who I succeeded as dean. Together with our dedicated faculty, they helped build the solid foundation that has sustained the growth and direction of the College of Management and helped us bring us to this day. Without their leadership, a college so young could not be so vibrant and so important to this economy and could not attract the type of gift that Lonnie and Carol has given to us. So please help me recognize both Dick and John. <laughs> On a personal note, I will close by telling a small story that I have to remember now very vividly. It was the day that uh, the golf course was dedicated and Lonnie was getting great accolades and he was hitting golf balls and after all the attention on him I went over to congratulate him and all he said to me is the next one is for the College of Management and today that statement becomes reality so thank you so much again Lonnie and Carol for your most generous gift of support to the Poole College of Management and before I become John Boehner, I think I'll end now and just say thank you.